So here's my studio. This is the office area. I bought a very inexpensive desk and installed all my printing equipment and supplies there. I have office supplies here and on my desk. Um, this is where I do all my drawing and all my pastel work here. Uh, over here I have a set of dresser drawers that are very convenient for storing my oil paints, my acrylics, watercolor, tempera, uh, pastels, paper supplies, and equipment. I just recently printed out all of my uh, pictures, drawings, and paintings into greeting card size, and uh, those are available now. Over here is a light table, which is very convenient when I'm doing pet portraits to get dimensions right. I have a bin of packing supplies when I made my artwork out and some miscellaneous stationery there. Big roll of packing paper for mailing. Um, extra canvases, of course I have tons of canvases in other rooms as well. My uh, easel is very convenient because it folds up when I do a demonstration. This is a painting I just finished from my time in Italy. This is Cortana and it just had an offer to buy, so I'm very excited about that. Um, I'm working on a picture uh, that I took in Shankway Terry, Italy. Here's the black and white version of it. And I always like to do a detailed drawing before I start painting just to make sure the uh, composition is correct. Uh, this stool is very helpful because I put my laptop on it with my reference photo. Um, have a set of lights here that I can angle anywhere I need them. I have a mall stick, which is spelled M-A-H-L. So this is a soft tip and you just put it across the canvas like so to rest your hand to do detailed work. Over here is where I do my painting. So it's just a simple drafting table with a glass palette. So I do all my mixings here, it cleans up very easily. Um, I use Gamasol, which is odorless, to clean my oil paints up with. And the brushes, I have found a great way to keep them supple and usable by soaking them in Murphy oil soap. So in between uh, painting, if they're a little dry, I just soak them. This is just a little bookshelf with some reference books. I'm a big fan of Monet and occasionally will do a uh, master study of one of the Impressionist work. Uh, some books that I've found very useful. Uh, this one is called Creative Authenticity by Ian Roberts and you can follow him on YouTube. Uh, he has a website, ianroberts.com and he's been a real, um, just inspiration. Uh, he's a wonderful artist as well as a teacher. Uh, this book, Art and Faith by Makato Fujimura, uh, I really enjoyed very much. It talks about uh, just the marriage of um, spirituality and creativity. It's highly recommended. Got this book from a friend, Your Creative Workspace, uh, which is just a, a guide to setting up your own home office or studio. So I just have uh, you know, some of my paintings up on the wall and just enjoy working in my space. Hope you enjoyed it.